Alright chat, today's plan, as you can see, we have a bunch of different sodas and we're gonna be trying all of them. We are probably gonna rate them, some of the good ones we'll put them to like this side and the bad ones we'll put to the left side. Is that why I'm better than your shit? Yeah, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we don't really have an order. I think we do the fun line first, let's just start from an end. We got the good old classic Fanta. It's a classic orange soda, there's nothing much to like say about it. I guess it's a uh, bing and sink it. I remember it being like, it tastes like more, but I want to say, because like I was in America once, their Fanta is way sweeter and more flavorful than ours is, because like ours is a little more bland. I haven't tried the strawberry one, but I think I've probably tried something similar to this yeah. in Indonesia, but it's not Fanta. It's just like a normal orange drink, like right. orange pulp drink, right. I guess that's without the carbonation, it just tastes like this. Yeah, I, I see what you mean. Well, also, we have here, we have the squash, which is so much better. In my opinion. It's, not it's just more flavorful, so I just kind of like it. So should we just put this at like the end section? Yeah, I, honestly, like, because there's room for, you know, mixing it up later. Yeah. Also, I wanted to get two of each, right? I thought about it, and I was like, well, first of all, we're probably not going to finish all, all of these. Fuck no. So I wouldn't want to waste more. <laughs> and two, that's gonna be double as expensive. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm a cheap guy, I don't know about you. So next up we have the 7-Up Zero Sugar. Well, the thing is, a lot of the brands, I don't know where the fuck the sugar variant is. It just doesn't exist. Oh, yeah. no, it's most of it's sugar. It's just sugar. zero sugar. The same with Sprite, which by the way, I, we didn't get because I couldn't find it. But Sprite was like on and off the market for the longest time, right? The only one that's been semi-available lately has been Sprite Zero. What is 7-Up again? Is it like lemony? Yeah, so it is... Like a little lemon? Re refreshing lemon and lime taste. I love lemon and lime in general. The good old Sprite, which is not Sprite, but 7-Up. <laughs> good one. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen 7-Up in Indonesia. You don't? No, I, I, I probably have, but I've never tried it at all. I can't remember if I had it when I was there. Probably I might not. have had. I mean, the, the normal one is like Sprite, uh, Cola, and Fanta. Fanta right. is pretty big in Southeast Asia, and I think like South America, maybe. Um, don't quote me on that, but I know it's quite big in Southeast Asia. Cheers, mate. <laughs> Basically, Sprite with a little bit more artificial sugar. Yeah, it's a little sweeter. Yeah, than Sprite. But I think it also, like, Sprite and 7 Up and those kind of sodas are kind of similar. Like, really closely similar. I'm not sure if I was blindfolded, right? I'm not sure I would be able to tell the difference between Sprite and 7 Up. Honestly, I think it's kind of the same as the Fanta. But I think, because generally I'm more of a lemon lime guy. Yeah. So I think I'd rate it higher than a Fanta to begin with. For me, it's around the same. Like, it. I don't have a preference. No. So, uh, like over orange or lemon and lime. Right. I would say there are more sodas with lemon and lime, so I guess this is something I'm more used to. Makes sense. But we could put it slightly above. Yeah, I think I want to do. So let's just like have Fanta is pretty much in the middle, and we can probably do Seven Up just above. I don't think I've ever had like the pepper. Oh, that smells weird. I don't Does think it? I really like this. I mean, I was told once that it's, it has kind of like a medicine taste. You know that? That is exactly what medicine would... Okay, I kind of see what people are I saying with the medicine. I think I'm going to put it away. What the way. fuck? That might that might just be really ass. I think that's a good amount. I'm going to take <laughs> judging, by the, judging by the smell alone, I think this is a good amount. Does it smell like cherry? Kind of a little bit. Like, it's like, like a, a bit of synthetic? It's like a mixture of synthetic cherry and like a lot of synthetic... Sweetener. Sweetener, yeah. That's what it's, it's probably because it's corn syrup, maybe. Maybe. Because if but. it's, I believe they use corn syrup in America compared to other sugar. Cheers. I have a good one on this one. <laughs> it's not bad. Not as bad as I thought it would be. These are alright. I wouldn't mind drinking it if someone, you know, put a gun to my head. But I want to say right because, like, let's say we're at a party or whatever, and it's the only thing they have, then I'd probably drink it. But... I'll, I'll drink this half. You would? Damn. You can put that at like... Yeah, I, I'm, 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 I'm... Let's put it like here for yeah, yeah. now. Right, next up is one of my personal favorites. Good old Pepsi Max. So I don't think we have these in Indonesia. You know? Max. I don't, right. I've never seen them. The thing about Pepsi Max, right, when I was in America, they don't call it Pepsi Max. They call it Pepsi Zero, which is I weird might, to me. I might have Pepsi Zero. Because the fact that they call it Pepsi Zero is kind of weird to me, because like... 
I thought America was all about maxing out, like bigger, better, and now they're going for zero. Like, hello? Oh, okay. Yeah. You can see where the biases came. Like, you I realized that I might have poured a little too much. Oh, well. It's good that you're here, because I would just put this in, like, top of the top, probably. It's going to be hard to yeah. beat, but I don't have to have a conversation about it. Cheers, man. Yeah. It's just great, in my opinion. So this is also... I'm not biasing it. This is of anything, but... Any sugary drinks with zero calories or like with zero sugar, I would right. go give it to Pepsi Max. This is yeah. I like with when it comes to sugar-free Coke or like cola, not Coke, but sugar-free cola, I think at least here, like it's always going to be a bit different depending on where in the world you are, because it might not taste exact the same. But at least from our versions, I'd say Pepsi Max is probably one of the better, if not the best, sugar-free cola. Yeah, I mean, I, I've tried uh, Cola Zero here, and it, it's fine, but it's like. I would say it's bland. It's more bland. It's just Pepsi bland. Max, it's like water. You can put it <laughs> at like the edge of the edge for now. Yeah, I think this is like actually a pretty good way of comparing so far because I think Dr. Paper is kind of oh, Pepsi Max is pretty good, and these were like kind of mid. So so far we have a pretty good like thing of basing it on. Yeah. I think we're down to moving on to the next one. Yep. And I don't actually know if this is a Danish thing or if this is like an international thing because it was very popular here in the Ooh. in the tens. So it's Fanta with passion fruit. I think it is. It's Fanta Exotic. I don't remember if it's international or if it's here, but it, it has like a very exotic, like multi-juice kind. That's or... crazy because for us, it's not exotic. This was one of my favorites before I was hooked on Pepsi Max. I don't know if it's synthetic really, but it's just like generally a pretty good like sugar soda. Well, cheers to the exotic and not so exotic Fanta, I guess. I really like that. It's just great. Yeah. It has a good sweetness. Right now, I'd probably put it somewhere between here, to be fair. In between the Pepsi and the, the 7-Up. Like, I would put it here. Yeah, I'd probably do the same, but I'm just more so thinking. We could probably just put these together and then always just input it, like, uh, down the line. Our next one is, uh, is it just a normal Coke? I think it's a normal Coke. Yeah. It's been so long since I've had a normal Coke. I, I'm really a Pepsi guy over a Coke guy. I'm more of a Coke guy. Well, I mean, like, if you take Pepsi Max and Coke Zero, then I'll take Pepsi Max anyway. Right. But I don't know what it is, but if you go to, like, a fast food chain uh, in Indonesia, you can go to KFC. Like, Wait, KFC is, like, Pepsi-based, no? Uh, we have... Pepsi and Coca-Cola. Oh, that's crazy, because here something. it's only Pepsi. Oh, wait, no, yeah, it might be just Pepsi, but, but I, I think... think Pepsi you... owns KFC. Might be, but if I go to, like, maybe, uh, I think McDonald's or something, you could get a cola, and I don't know what it is, the combination of just, like, having freshly made uh, cola and with ice, it's just the best. It is good. That is way better than anything you can get in a can or in a bottle. Also, the thing about, like, something like Coke Zero, right? Coke Zero in a can or a bottle fucking sucks, but at restaurants, when it's like the, the syrup mix, yeah, the syrup that mix just awesome. tastes fucking, that tastes good. I'm down for Coke Zero in form of syrup. Why did I pour so much? I'm a soda guy. It's brew and brew, huh? Anyway, cheers, mate. Cheers. It's a classic. Yeah, I always feel like Coke has this kind of lingering sweetness. Yeah. Like, I would say one thing, the Coke here tastes less sweet than the one I could get in Indonesia, I would say. Right. I think it is probably a little bit more calories as well. I feel like their sweetness is, it's weird sweetness in my, it's hard to explain, right? Because yeah. yeah. as I said, like, it's kind of lingering sweetness, and it's like, it just sits there. I would put it between the 7 of the I would feel like. I really enjoyed this one. I think I'd probably... Oh, are you thinking about this fence or this fence? This fence. Okay, yeah, so, so here. Like, yeah. Yeah, that's that's kind of where I was thinking. Or, I remember Coke being worse than it actually was. But no, I've never had complaints about Coke. Be, like, it's not that I have complaints, but it's just like... I don't know. I guess I'm just biased because I'm a Pepsi kind of guy. But honestly, it's better than I remember. Good old Coke Vanilla. No, it's not good old for me because this does not exist in Southeast Asia. I don't know why I said good old because we don't fucking have it either. We used to have it. It's discontinued. Like, I've heard from a lot of American friends that it's kind of goaded over there. But I feel like I remember it being a little weird. Like, the vanilla is kind of off-putting oh, from what I remember. It's kind of weird. This is basically if you put, like, vanilla extract in cold cola. I would imagine so. I should really start taking smaller portions. <laughs> That's the thing. Wait, same thing. Yeah, it's so weird with the vanilla smell. Yeah. It's just like Coke and then you add vanilla extract. That's just yeah, but, but I wonder if they have sugar and vanilla in it. Or if the, if the sweetness is from the vanilla. Anyways, cheers. Cheers, man. It's fine, I would drink it. But I wouldn't buy it. 
it's worse than a normal Coke. It might just be what you're used to, but I just feel like the vanilla is so weirdly off-putting. I, again, for me, I think it's because vanilla is just, I associate that with dessert cake. Yeah, I don't know, actually know if I want to put it below a Fanta, like here. I think I would put it there. Yeah, right? Personally, I would put it there. I think it would as well. Like, I'd wait, I, I'd prefer I'd, to string these to the yeah, that. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I think I'd rate it here as well, yeah. Let's do that. We can always change it later. Yeah. It's not final by any means. It's just uh, overall, because like, of course, we're gonna, you know, have different opinions yeah. going through them all. Next up is apparently the Indonesian classic Fanta, the Fanta Strawberry. I don't think I've had this one. I think it's pretty new to we, us. We even have like, uh, so if you go to like one of the street vendors in Indonesia, you can have what's called um, like a happiness soda. So it's basically like strawberry soda, and then you add condensed milk, and then you just mix that up. What it the tastes, fuck? It's awesome. I don't think I've ever had a strawberry soda, to be fair. Oh, wait, I didn't cleanse they my glass if you want I would prefer Fanta over Sprite. Fanta over Sprite? This Fanta, the strawberry one, but I, I still haven't tasted this one, so I, I wouldn't know. So this doesn't smell the same. Well, I have a feeling, because like, if you look at it, which size is this? Oh, it's an American. Ah, okay. So this is the American, apparently, so it might be different from what you had. Wait to find out. Well, Cheers. guess the first time for the strawberry soda. That is weird. Wow. That's like, um, so it I has the same taste as like synthetic strawberry candy. So I used to have like this one soap that I used to use. <laughs> Do when not compare soap. this to soap. So it tastes like how that soap smelt. But I would put it above this. But below everything else. Yeah, I think I'd do the same, honestly. Because I think yeah. I'd rather have it than the... I, like, I would go drink small. this. I would still drink this. If yeah, I'd probably good. finish it. So the next one is, ah, uh, Coke Zero. No way! Okay. Coke Zero! Yippee! What's this? That's the AI one. Ah! It's so fucking weird. I don't even know if it came out, like, half a year ago. Just randomly, when, like, all the chat GBT shit stuff started exploding, they just came out with an AI Coke, and I'm like, what the fuck is that? They didn't have more of them, but this one, it was not on the shelf, it was, like, lying at the bottom, and I was like, well, it doesn't seem broken or anything, so I guess I'm gonna just join it. <laughs> so it was the last one. I really wanted to taste it at the time, but I just didn't get around to it, so I guess now's the time. Well, Coke Zero, good old classic. Yeah, that's still pretty good. It had more flavor than I expected. But it's I feel not like... as potent as Pepsi Max. No, and it's not as potent as when it's like a syrup version of Coke Zero, because that just tastes better, because it has a bit more flavor. That's the thing. I, I don't know where you would put it, but I would put it below Coke. Like the same. Coke. I'd rather have Coke Classic than a Coke Zero. Yeah. I agree on that. What are you thinking? I think I was, here. I was thinking here. So maybe we can take the, the middle. And I mean, we can do this here. then. Yeah. We That's like the, the middle. Yeah, okay. middle ground. This one right here is the Coke it looks really nice though. AI. It has a really, really like cool design. look. Yeah. How did they do it? Co-created with AI, right? Did they just open up ChatGPT and be like, "Yo, can you make a soda?" Yeah, I could just imagine the uh, employee over in Coca Cola just putting in all the fucking secret ingredients just to like make this better. Hello, ChatGPT. Based on the Coke formula, please make a, a better version. I can't tell what this is. It just smells like a uh, normal. Cola, but with a little bit stronger, like lime. Anyways, there's only one way to find out, so cheers, mate. That tastes weird. If I didn't see the branding, I would not think this is Coke. I like the aftertaste, though. The aftertaste is pretty nice. I don't know if I like it. Perfect. I was gonna say I might rank it possibly lower than the Dr. Pepper. Wait, oh, I might need to try course. it again. I would probably put it above the Coke vanilla. It's not bad. I wouldn't say it's bad. It's like really boring. Yeah. Like really boring. Yeah, I mean, that's why I told you. Just like Coke, put in some ice and just water it down. That's just what it tastes like. It has like a, um, not a sour aftertaste, but like a, not bitter either. Maybe like a mix of a bitter sour. Yeah, and that's basically taste. what like, if you take like, what's it called? The I peel, guess. Like a lime peel. You might be right as lime. I was probably going to put it either here or here, but if you want to put it here, I'm down for that. Yeah, I, I, I would drink, uh, I would finish that, but I would not finish the uh, cola vanilla. Honestly, I think I'd rather finish the Coke vanilla, but I'm down to put it here. What's up next even? Is that just the Pepsi? Pepsi. Oh, it is Pepsi. So it's three, that, you know, this is the normal Pepsi. Yeah. The next one is the, the Japanese Pepsi. So, normal Pepsi, and then Japanese up next. Cheers, yeah. Rangers. I prefer the Pepsi Max. I do as well, but I think I'd, I'd put it on the same level as 
or Coke Classic. I would play one worse. But that's also because I have a bias towards cold sure, sure. compared to Pepsi. But I'm at the point where I'm like, I, I wouldn't pick Coke Classic over a Pepsi, and I wouldn't pick a normal Pepsi over a Coke Classic. That's kind of where I'm at, at least. So I would probably put it like somewhere here. We could just put it on top if you want, just make it the same. Just make it a stack? Yeah. <laughs> we do that. I'm done. Oh, yeah, wait, yeah. I have a can. I just realized. I was like, why don't you put it on there? <laughs> Next up is the Japanese Pepsi. Oh, that's weird. I just realized. It's a Pepsi, but it's cola flavored. Right, but that's the thing. Like, cola is a type of soda. So, like, you can have... There's a billion Ooh, types it's, of cola. This smells good, though. This might be on top of the normal Pepsi and the normal Coke. We're just going to have a fucking tower. <laughs> just smells like a more potent cola. It might be a little more potent. Yeah, it smells Anyways, like... there's only one way to buy an out cheese, man. It's more limey. And it's a little bit less sweet. But I like it. I kind of think I prefer ours. There's the initial hit, right? Yeah. Which is fine. Yeah. Then there's like the middle part, which was kind of weird to me. It's just more lime, I guess. It, I don't know if it's lime. It might be lime. It could be. Might be. I realize that my taste buds might just be ass. <laughs> and that might be problematic. That's why you're sitting at that side. Right. The bad side, I guess. Yeah. I would honestly put it below a normal Pepsi. Or our Pepsi. Um, I would probably put it either one above or the same. Would you put it above? Yeah, with these two right now, yeah. I feel like that's just a bit more fresh for me. So we'll take the middle ground. Is you. this dangerous? Um, probably uh, for your carpet, maybe. These are basically Orphean Power. That's why it's a stack. <laughs> I didn't think we were going to stack it. Why didn't we start stacking? I don't know. We can just stack this later on the set. But that's going to go horribly wrong. We are on to the last can. And I think I want to do this because this is Pepsi Max Lime, right? Coke, at least here, they recently released the uh, uh, Zero, Coke Zero Lime. So I think it would be kind of fun to do these in a row just to see which one is like better. Oh, that smells pretty good. It is decently limey, which is weird, right? Who would have thought that the lime soda had lime in it? Pepsi Max Lime. Cheers. That's good. I, like I really that. just like that one as much as I like it. I don't think I'd put it over the normal Pepsi. The reason being, because just of personal preference, right? What I said before, I can do like the lime version and, you know, yeah, yeah. And for a bit of time and then I need to break off a bit and then, and the normal Pepsi just always go to in my head. Yeah, I would put it on par with the Fanta, with the exotic. I think I put it just one below. I mean, I, I personally, I would put it here. Oh, like on top. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not to do that. I really like the taste. It is really good. You can for sure taste that like it's synthetic lime. Yeah, for sure. It's, it's like, like it has a nice kick to it. Yeah, that's the thing. Like considering the fact that it is synthetic lime, I think it's really good. I think we're doing this one first just to compare oh, the okay. two lime ones. I know it's a bit out of order, but I think it makes sense to compare the the two limey. This smells like soap. Like the, the cheapo soap, the oh, bar no. soap we could get from the hotel. Do not tell me it smells like soap. So you have to tell me that it doesn't smell like soap. Dumb. Let me say it like this, okay? I don't want to say it necessarily smells like soap, but I could imagine a soap that would have a similar smell. That is my cop-out answer. <laughs> <laughs> this is new, so I'm really down to try this at least. So, cheers, mate. With the soap. So cool. Oh yeah, that's soap. I'm going to put it way down. Wow, it's way worse than the other one. Yeah. Holy fuck, that's not even close. I still don't know if I'm on the soap train, but it's way worse than the Pepsi Co uh, the Pepsi line. I think I might put it some like here. Yeah, I would put it on par with the, like this or like yeah, one one off before or after. I would put it there. I'm honestly surprised. I'd rather have the the normal at least the normal Cola Zero. Yeah. Do we want to put it here? We can put it in between. Because yeah, that's what I'm saying. We shouldn't stack them. No, no, I didn't want to stack them. I was just yeah. more so you know kind of aiming. But we're gonna oh. go with the do now. Are you feeling the like the pressure of the soda? I mean, I've already been burping for, right, I've been burping okay. for the last thirty minutes, so oh, I'm fine. Why did I not notice? The good old classic. Never tried one. Before. Gaming really? juice. You haven't been gaming, eating Doritos, and drinking the dew. So I believe this is okay. It does say citrus blast. I was about to say I think it has like a, a, a lemony taste to it. It can't really be compared to stuff like Seven Up, from what I remember, considering it's supposed to be lemony. I don't remember the exact taste, but I feel like it has a very unique taste. Well, what do we find out? Cheers. Oh, that's pretty good. I quite enjoy that. 
Honestly, it was more like 7 up than I thought, <laughs> to be fair. For all the memes that Mountain Dew has gotten through the years, it's actually pretty good. I'll put that in between these two, I think. Yeah, I'd probably do the same, actually. I, I agree I'd probably have it over the, the Coke Zero, to be fair. I think that's fine. I don't want to push it too much. Plus, I don't think we can line them up on a complete line. So it might have been a good thing that we stacked. <laughs> What's the next thing? Dr. Pepper Zero. Oh, fuck. Is Dr. Pepper Zero the redemption arc from the Dr. Pepper? Because, like, the so. Dr. Pepper was not great. There's a reason it's down here. No, Maybe it's no. just because we're not used to it. Maybe I, we're just I, not I true like soda in no, like that. That just smells like it's cough syrup. <laughs> I really don't like that. What the fuck? Why is it so potent? <laughs> I don't know. In my head, it's like a smelling salt reaction. Like, I smell it, I'm like... <laughs> <laughs> like it's a smelling salt. Well, we might have a new contention of the worst. We might. Cheers. I don't feel any difference from the normal Dr. Pepper. No. It tastes exactly the same. Honestly, I think it might be at the end of it. Because right now, I'm tasting a very weird bland taste that I think might I think be that's because of the, the lack of the sugar. Yeah, I think that's that. So I think that's the difference. But I think it's the same. And I'm also, I'm, I'm actually getting used to the taste now with the two sips that I've had. Honestly. But I still wouldn't prefer it. I wouldn't take it. So I would. Put it at the end of the other Dr. Pepper. I think, honestly, it's just the at the end like completely at the end right here i think that's where it fits in personally at least the the original dr pepper or like the sugar variant had a little bit going with like the sweetness of the taste where no, the other like one which my mouth just focuses on that the, that taste. medicine taste yeah, so oh, there is that. just fucking medicine Shreps. okay the next up is shreps lemon this is one of my favorite fucking sodas it's so good it's a lemon soda and it's just so good it smells like limestone yeah. I have a very, very weird, like, relation to Brother, the taste buds and smell. I don't even know if I've ever come across limestone. Oh, it's so good. Anyway, I think you're gonna like this one. Cheers. Oh, that's good. It's so good. What I like about this is that it's not sweet all the way through. It really hits you with the lemon and then it has, like, a little bit of sweet aftertaste. I probably wouldn't drink this by itself, but I feel like if you combine this as a mixer with someone with right. something else then it would be amazing personally i put it above seven up i would say it's probably on par for me on par yeah i think we can stack mm -hmm. one you think on i kind of just don't want to make it fall over that's the thing that's a lemon this is a no sugar variant i don't know if we have a sugar variant i couldn't find it so honestly i don't remember if i've ever had this one it's not like something i've smelled before it's something random it's not very like it doesn't have that big of a smell it's not potent well, anyway, cheers, man. Oh, wow. The lemon is really, really, really strong. Yeah. But I enjoy that. Really punching. I think they do it a little worse than the Sweps. But I think it is, this is way more lemony than the Sweps. For sure. Like, they're going for the lemon lemon. Yeah. These guys are, like, saving, not saving, but, like, but they're... I feel like they're, this is just, like, you take water, like, carbonated water, and just put, like, lemon juice in it. Yeah. I think I'd prefer a normal Fanta, but I think I'd prefer this over the Strawberry Fanta. No, I prefer this over any of the Fantas we tried, ex except the exotic one. Right. I would put it on top of the Dew, or like, on the side, like, better than Dew. You'd put it on better than Dew? Yeah. For me, personally. Ooh. I don't know where you would put that. I think I'd put it worse than Dew. Personally, I would have put it here. Then we can put but it But I'm down to go, like, here, yeah. or like, because I think I'd also have a Coke cereal with this. That's the middle ground, but personally, I would put it on top of the dew, or like better than Well, oh, I was gonna be like, <laughs> this stack wow, is gonna be mean, bad. Stack like this, brother. Okay. <laughs> That's gonna go wrong in every single way. We have two more left. This was recently introduced here. I don't know if it's global, but this is Pepsi Max. Mango. What is it? Mango, which um, I've had it one time. That I've tried. It's, it's all right. It's all right. Yeah. But it's not great. Like, I bought it once and I haven't bought it again. Yeah, it's been since I've last had it, so I'm down to try it again. Just to see if I, you know, where I would rank it against some of the other stuff. But I probably wouldn't seek it out, to be fair. Cheers, mate. It's very artificial mango flavor. Oh, yeah. And it's, like, kind of late. You can taste this mango. So, like, the advertising is on point. I think I would put that here in between these two. Would you really put it over these? Yeah. 
I mean, that's person, personally for me because I love mangoes. Well, I yeah, like that, mangoes. That's... I really like the fruit, but I don't know how I feel about it being in a soda. That's my problem here. Would you put it over Coke Zero? Yeah, that's me. I would go here. Then we can take the middle again and... So, like, here? Yeah, here? On par, on, we can put it on par with the Fanta. It makes sense. All right. Last one. At least. Oh, I don't know about you, I but really, I do not like cherry I soda. Really like cherry that. soda is so fucking ass. Why is cherry soda still in production? Who buys this? Something has to be the worst. It's been so long since I've had it. So it might like, then again, most of this is for sure like an acquired taste. Yeah. I didn't like it when I was younger, but it's been like oh, wow. years since I've had it. So I might have changed. I mean, Mine? at one point I hated Coke Zero, so, I, and now I've tried again, it's fine. See one way to find out. Well, like for the last one, scroll. scroll. Not that bad. I wouldn't put it at the worst. I think it's way less potent, the cherry, than it used to be. Well, it might be because it's the zero sugar version. Might be. Because, yes. like, I remember just the cherry kicking you in the head, just being like, Hello, knocking on your door saying, I'm here, and I'm here to stay, and it was just not enjoyable. But this is doable. I I'd rank this higher than the AI. Yeah, yeah, I would say so as well. I'd probably it's put probably, it here. I would say it's it's the same as the, the Strawberry Fanta. Strawberry Fanta? Yeah. I would, I, like, are I would you, Are it. you down to put it here, just for the, like, yeah. the compromise, just in between these? Yeah. That's how teal is. Yeah. So thinking that up here is the best and this is the worst, I'm happy we did this. This was fun. Yeah. I have to, have to do this again if I ever get any more money. <laughs> I can afford to do this. But yeah, I want to do more of these. I think this could be fun in the future. 